books of The Walking Dead, which is a show I watch uh, non-stop, so I'm pretty pumped about that. Uh, so I'm not going to talk to you guys, I'm just going to sit here and read. Is that cool? I'm kidding. Done. Yeah, video, dude, because my battery's going to go flat. So, Hi. how you guys doing? Oh, all right. Um, I feel like a motivational speaker up here. Let's go out there and achieve, guys. How do you think uh, Jeremy will react to Elena's transformation? Whoa. When she transforms? Since when? Uh, you know, I think Jeremy, his, uh, his main objective since he's lost so many people, is to keep the people he loves alive and safe. And um, he's failed to do that yet again. And uh, I think with Jeremy, anytime he feels powerless, he's gonna work hard to try to become more powerful. Um, so I don't know what he's gonna do, and that's up to our brilliant writers. Uh, but I, I think he's, uh, I don't think he's gonna be stoked. Hi. If you were What's your name? Amy. Hi, Amy. Hi. Do you, ever, do you know any songs uh, called Amy? Damien Damien Rice? No. No? Alright. What's your question? If you were Nina Durbin for 24 hours, what would you do? If we were alone for 24 hours? If you were her. Oh, if I were her? <laughs> uh, a lot of jumping jacks. No, I'm kidding. Uh, <laughs> I, uh, <laughs> in front of a beer, no, uh, oh, no, that was, that, that, okay, never mind, that sounded wrong in so many ways, I, 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 was, I was more talking about, okay, uh, I don't know, I don't know, I would play with my cats, but, <laughs> oh, oh my god, <laughs> no, <laughs> okay, uh, alright, next question. Um, I think they should just all get together. And, uh, you know, uh, I, I, I think, uh, you know, the way it was written um, is Anna is, you know, was his true love. Uh, you know, uh, because they kind of, I mean, he, you know, dated Vicky, but more because she was that older chick he had no chance with, and he got her, so he was like, alright, sweet. Um, and Anna was this creature that, you know, she was a very powerful vampire that could have killed him at any time. But she connected to him on some uh, some sort of level, you know, um, and and that's why I know a lot of people were pissed about him hooking up with uh, Anna when him, uh, when Jeremy and Bonnie were together. Um, but it was just that intense passion that he lost, and he never really got to say goodbye. Uh, and with Bonnie, you know, I think he does really care for her. They have, uh, you know, they've uh, grown up together. Um, so I don't know. I don't know. I don't know what I root for. I think that's more Jeremy's subconscious somewhere up here. Um, hi. Well, we were having Melissa out before. She mentioned the romance scene that you guys had to do. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, how did she explain it, though? Did she tell you everything um, about it? Yeah, pretty much. And we also had Nathaniel helping out with the acting. Uh, <laughs> what was with the coaches? Well, you to read uh, I mean, this is one of my first love scenes, you know, I mean, I was, uh, first of all, I kind of wanted to impress Melise, uh, and second of all, you know, I hadn't really had my shirt off on camera before, so I was trying to push up some sit-ups when I could, um, and, you know, they yelled action, and, oh no, they yelled, uh, uh camera, speeding, uh, and then right before they yelled action, I was like, okay, I'm going to do a couple of sit-ups, my feet, her head was at, or at my feet, and my head was at her feet, and it just like shot in her direction. <laughs> it's just like, you know, oh she gosh. just was laughing uncontrollably, and it was supposed to be this sincere, beautiful moment between us. And uh, I, I just had to go ahead and mess that up, huh? <laughs>